folks, welcome to another episode of Adventures in Dog Training with American Standard Dog Training and American Overwatch Canine Services. This is Lev. She is our newest recruit to the four-week puppy board and train program. We just picked her up yesterday from some local clients here in South Florida. She is uh, eight weeks going on nine weeks old. She is a Swiss Shepherd. I am no breed expert on this. This is our first Swiss Shepherd, but the little bit of research I've done in speaking with the owners, it's similar to a German Shepherd, very similar to a German Shepherd, um, but not a German Shepherd. So this is not a white German Shepherd, it's a Swiss Shepherd. They happen to be all white, so all Swiss Shepherds are white. Whereas some German Shepherds, I guess there's some albino German Shepherds or very light uh, colored German Shepherds, not to be confused with what we have here, the Swiss German Shepherd. Excuse me, the Swiss Shepherd. Bear with me, it's very confusing. But very similar, okay, very similar. And what I found so far is, at least Lev, because she's the first one we've ever had, extremely, extremely intelligent. As you notice, we already have hand commands, and this is uh, the very beginnings of the third lesson. So we'll say two lessons in, she already had it. By the time we finish the second lesson, she's already charged up on hand commands. Uh, extremely motivated for food. Um, I'm expecting really good results from her. So I want you guys to stay tuned. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe. And uh, follow along with our adventures in dog training. We'll be taking her everywhere. I expect her to perform to a really high level, and I can't wait to see how far we get her in, in uh, four weeks' time. She's going to be off-leash trained. We're going to train her up on e-collars, pinch collars, uh, food luring, positive reinforcement, marker training, uh, sits down, stays, hears, heels, going on the place board, going on different place boards, going in her crate. You name it, we're training all of that in four weeks, and uh, we're going to show you how we do it if you guys come along for the ride. So come on over here and frame. She's checking out someone that's walking behind us, behind camera. There she is, very observant. I notice her very observant of other people. Um, and this is great at this age. Very interested. So uh, I did read a little bit about them, and they're supposed to be very, maybe not such a great guard dog, uh, but very aware of their surroundings. Uh, so quick to alert, quick to bark, and let everybody know, hey, there's someone um, out there that that might be a bad guy. So uh, I don't know if they do any protection work with this breed. I guess we'll find out if she's got it in her. Um, but if they're that close to the German Shepherd, I don't see why they wouldn't have it in them. Uh, but one thing we did find last night when we were hanging out with her, as soft and cuddly as she looks, She's actually as soft and cuddly as she looks. She is like a sweet, uh, we call them a cuddle bug. She's a cuddle bug. A lot of dogs don't like to cuddle or maybe cuddle for her. She's, there's a, a jogger went by. She wants to check her out. Um, she actually will hang out with you for an extended period of time. And as long as she's got a nice full belly, she'll hang out with you. And so her, her fur right now, she's still got that puppy fur. She is as soft as a bunny. And the other thing that we found interesting too, ever since we brought her here, our Dish TV for some reason, we're getting much better uh, uh, reception. I don't know why that would be. Um, it could have something to do with, with these things right here. <laughs> it's just a joke, folks. She hasn't grown into her ears yet. She's still a little floppy. But anyways, she is uh, super cute and we're very happy to have her. And uh, I want you guys to follow along as we train her up to be... Uh, the best that she can be. So thanks for watching and we will see you on the next video.